Rowan Holman out of Sonora, California, Northern California. Outstanding sophomore. First off, first time really at the national stage for you at the high school level. Yeah. How was the experience for you overall and how did the race go for you? Yeah, it was it was amazing. I wasn't sure, you know, what to expect going into this race. Just, you know, being in, you know, such an amazing group of runners, you know, some of the top 40, you know, high schools in the nation. So I went into this race. My plan was just to, you know, go out a little conservative. I, you know, went out towards the back of the pack. And then, you know, when the last mile came around, I just picked as many people off as I could. No, even good. though you had an outstanding freshman year, an outstanding sophomore year, it seems like you hadn't really knocked heads with people from out of state. This yeah. time you did. Yeah. Were there nerves huh? beforehand? How did that go for you? Yeah, I, I was expecting to be a little more nervous, but I mean, you know, looking down the line, you see the fast, some of the fastest people in the country. I mean, it's pretty overwhelming. And then, you know, being called in and announced, you just got to, I was trying to handle my nerves. And I think I did good. I mean, I felt... I was just so pumped to be here. It's it's amazing being out here. Bro, and yesterday was a walkthrough on the course. Yeah. Going into the race today, what did you feel was going to be key for you today? Yeah, I just I just knew that a lot of kids were going to be you know super excited to you know obviously to be here and they're going to go out a little too hard. So looking at the hills and the downhill and kind of that section of the course over there, I knew that I just needed to get out conservative and then you know see what I could do going down the you know, the last hill coming to the finish. So as a sophomore, you were. Uh, Pretty yeah, impressive. yeah. Pretty impressive. <laughs> uh, track and field. What's yeah. What's the story there? Yeah. So last year I got I got sick for you know most of track, so I have super slow times. But this year I'm feeling better than ever, so it should what be. Kind of was it? I got mono. Yeah. Yep. This year, what are you going to specialize in events wise? Do you have any idea? I think you know mile and two mile. I'll probably focus on the two mile this year, uh, but mile and two mile will be my events. How long yeah. have you been running? I've been running since I was, you know, seven or eight years old. So, really yeah, and I've been going to nationals, you know, for Junior Olympics, you know, every year. Um, so, I mean, this is definitely a step up from that, but I'm definitely used to, you know, the high level of competition. So, like the high school, even though you've raced really, really yeah, well. no, th this is a lot different than that. So. Growing in your opinion, how did your season go for you this year? I think it, it was really good. You know, in summer, you know, I just was able to start running again after the sickness. So. Uh, my training was just getting going through the beginning races of this year, like Woodbridge and stuff. So I think we peaked like the perfect time. I mean, I felt even better at this race than I did at state. So I think th this season really went, you know, pretty perfect. So it's good. Right, going home in 22nd nationally, he's an outstanding first two years of high school. Still got sophomore track coming up and then upperclassmen. So great job this weekend. Thank you. Thank you.